Let's do all the movies that came out January 2022 in theaters. First of all, you had The Free Five Five, Free 55 action spy film directed by Simon Kinberg. Then you had American Siege, came out January 7th, action thriller written and directed by Edward Drake. And then you had Scream, the, yeah, j just Scream is the title here, came out January 14th, it's the fifth installment in the Scream franchise, directed by Matt Bettinelli Olpin and Tyler Gillette. Then you had Shattered, came out January 14th, thriller film directed by Luis Pri Prieto. And then The King's Daughter came out January 21st, action-adventure fantasy film directed by Sean McNamara, based on the 1997 novel The Moon and the Sun by Vonda and McIntyre. I don't know if I pronounced that right. Then you had Sir Cyrano, came out January 21st, musical romantic drama directed by Joe Wright, based on the 2018 stage musical, the same name by Erica Schmidt, and then also based on a play, came out in 1897 called Cyrano de Bergerac, done by Edmund Rostand, and then you had The Tiger Rising, came out January 21st. Drama film written and directed by Ray Giratana, based on the 2001 book of the same name by Kate Di Camillo. Then you had War Hunt, came out January 21st. Action horror thriller directed by Mauro Borelli. And then Redeeming Love came out January 21st, Western Drama, directed by D.J. Caruso, based on the 1991 novel of the same name by Francine Rivers. And that's it right there for all the January new releases. So I actually didn't end up seeing a single new theatrical release this month. There wasn't anything here that actually caught my attention that got me interested hey I mean, now that i'm looking at it i'm like okay the king's daughter is one i could be interested in watching uh, aside from that i mean a lot of these other movies are ones i could be interested in watching it's just back in january 2022 i didn't feel the need to see the any of these movies in theaters so once again, you have, a sl you have a slow month in January, not really much major is actually coming out, which is to be expected, honestly. That'll be it for now.